Now to a wild scene on a college basketball court. A player and a fan getting into it. This is not the first time that Oklahoma State's Marcus Smart has showed his temper. But was he really at fault here? ABC's Michelle Franzen is on the story. Michelle, good morning. Well, good morning, Dan. The promising Oklahoma State guard took a pass playing professional basketball and his welcome return this year to the courts now tarnished by an altercation with a fan in the stand. In the final moments of the Oklahoma State game against Texas Tech, adrenaline turned into an altercation between player Marcus Smart and a fan in the stands. An out of bounds move that marred the game and could land the Oklahoma State star player in the hot seat. That's disgusting behavior. Smart was trying to block a shot with just seconds on the clock when he landed in the crowd. Officials say it appears words were exchanged before Smart is seen shoving the fan. Smart received a technical foul and now his coach and Big 12 Conference Commissioner will be reviewing the tape to see what, if any other disciplinary action, should be taken. Smart, considered one of last year's top drafts for the NBA, decided to stay on the college courts for his sophomore year. The scene is eerily reminiscent of the malice in the palace back in November of 2004, when a brawl broke out between players and fans after fan John Green threw a cup at Indianapolis Pacers player Ron Artest, now known as Meta World Peace. Now another fight's breaking out in front of the Pistons bench. However, this may not be such a cut and dry case. Witnesses to the altercation, as well as Marcus Smart himself, claim that Jeff Orr, the fan who Smart pushed, was yelling racial slurs at the player. The incident is still under review. This young athlete's public perception and possible professional basketball future in jeopardy by this unfortunate move. So what's next? Well, the Big 12 Conference says it hasn't had an incident like this before involving a player and a fan. The commissioner is set to review the incident along with the conference's rules for sportsmanship. Dan, Bianca, Michelle, thank you.